Hello and welcome to Revolution 101. This is a guided movement practice to generate courage in the body and help you access the power you need to be a positive force in the world. We're each called upon to take actions that will contribute to a culture of justice and sustainability, and this takes immense courage. There are so many forces that make change difficult, including those from without and those from within. This is an opportunity for you to overcome any obstacles you face in the role you seek to play in our cultural transformation. This practice can be done anywhere, but it's best to do it someplace that you feel free to move around and can make some sounds if you want to. I encourage you to modify any part of this exercise to accommodate your unique body. Start by getting comfortable wherever you are, closing your eyes, and taking deep breaths in through the nose and out through the mouth. Breathe into any places of tension and allow yourself to fully relax. With each inhale and exhale, your awareness is inhabiting more and more of your physical presence. Release any residual concerns about the past or the future or any self-consciousness you may have so that you can really be with yourself with trust and respect. Notice the emotions and sensations that you're currently experiencing and offer yourself radical acceptance of all that you bring to this moment. And now we're going to take even bigger breaths, almost like we're exaggerating our breathing, and we're going to pick up the tempo a little. This time, let your body begin to move with your breath, either in a swaying, rocking, or wave pattern, so your whole body is following the rhythm of your breath. Let your head move freely, let your arms billow or flop around. Let your hips and torso be fluid and alive. And let your legs and feet be rooted and flexible so the rest of your body is fully supported in its movements. And now I'd like you to try shaking your hands as if you're trying to shake some water off of them. Shaking your hands vigorously. Let this movement get big so that it reaches all the way up to your shoulder blades so you can really feel the release through your whole arm, your chest, and your upper back. And now allow this movement to start to spread to your whole body as you pick up speed and begin a full body release of any blockages that are holding you back. Your legs can send waves of movement up your body by shifting your weight from side to side, vibrating your knees back and forth, bouncing up and down on your toes, or jumping. Keep moving your arms in any way that helps you release and let go. Really let your head and face relax so any thoughts or mental patterns can be loosened up. Keep breathing with strong breaths and allow yourself to make sounds if you need to. You can exhale loudly, growl, roar, or anything that will help you release. If you start to feel self-conscious or even a little ridiculous, allow that to be part of the experience. This is your opportunity to release and let go of any fear, anxiety, or worry that you no longer need. Keep seeking and releasing deeper and deeper layers of fear so that as you let go of one layer, you can go on to the next layer until you feel fully alive, fully energized. Awaken your wild animal body and fully surrender to it. Feel the power of the earth, the power of the land coursing through you, giving you strength. You are shaking free from all constraints and letting this power take over your body. Feel yourself as the force of nature you are, here to embody your highest vision for the world. Take one last moment to give it your all, hold nothing back. Take all the passion that lives inside of you and set it free and turn it loose upon the world. Now gradually coming to rest, your body again comes to stillness as you integrate this experience. See if you can crystallize this experience and anchor it in your awareness by finding an image or a word or a phrase or even a sensation in your body. I encourage you to take a moment afterwards to find some paper and write down any words or images that you might want to remember in the future. Thank you so much for joining me. I wish you great courage in your offerings to the world. We need every single one of us to heal this world together.